Years in the planning, local farmers have a new facility in Atmore to take their peanut crops to to be processed. Not only is it good news for farmers, but as Debbie Williams tells us tonight, it's a huge boost to the Atmore economy. Peanuts, a money crop for farmers, and now a new facility closer to home to shell, grade, and ship those peanuts around the world. Coastal growers cut the ribbon on a $90 million, 400,000 square foot facility that brought 60 new jobs to Atmore, and by this time next year, there will be 60 more. It's changed the town's attitude. You know, it's from, we were always, we were doing good, but we wasn't doing this good. It's just, you just couldn't get it. Better. What used to be a cotton field now houses a state-of-the-art shelling facility that was built on time and on budget and in the middle of a pandemic. One day it was we had cotton here. Next day, we look at what we grow in buildings. Organizers say one person that was instrumental in this facility being built is not a farmer, was a coach, and is now U.S. Senator Tommy Tuberville, who calls this nothing short of a miracle. Hundreds and hundreds of farmers that now don't have to go hundreds of more miles to have their have their crops processed. It'll make them more money. They'll be able to pay more money to their people that work for them. They just, you know, that, that's the reason you call it a miracle. Farmers in a 50-mile radius of Atmore will use the facility, already shipping Alabama peanuts to 11 countries on three continents. And folks here say that's just the beginning. In Atmore, Debbie Williams, WKRG News 5.